Cinco de Mauso, by Judy Cox, illustrated by Jeffrey Evelyn. On the 5th of May, Mouse woke up and wriggled his whiskers. Spicy smells tickle his nose. Beany, cheesy, ricey smells. A Mexican fiesta. Fantastico. Mouse crawled out of his hidey hole. Where was the fiesta? Not in the bathroom where the kids brush their teeth. Not in the bedroom where mom folded laundry. Not in the kitchen where dad washed dishes. Mouse slipped out the front door and set off to explore. Mouse scampered down alleyways, past sidewalks and streetlights. He didn't see greedy cat stalk him down the street. Before long, Mouse stopped at the edge of the city park. What size? met his eyes. All around were people eating, singing, dancing, strolling, playing. All around were food and drink, sombreros, serapes, and bright paper flowers. Cinco de Mayo. His eyes grew round as he beheld a confetti-covered piñata stuffed with candy and shaped like a burro hanging in a tree above the plaza. I must have that for my fiesta, he said to himself. He jumped, but the enticing piñata swung far out of reach. But all around were people eating, dropping snacks for mouse-sized meals, yummy foods he'd never tasted before, tacos, tamales, chorizos, and flan. When mouse was full, he dozed under the shade of a canopy. Cat crouched in the flower bed, tail up and head down waiting for his chance. But all around came dancers stamping, heels stomping, toes tapping. Mouse woke up and dashed away from cat, ducking between dancers' pounding feet, zigging and zagging, jigging and jagging. Cat pounds. But miss his prey as Mouse darted beneath the stage. Mouse heard the mariachis play, heard the guitarron, the trumpets, the sweet voice violin, heard the boom of fireworks and people shouting, Viva Mexico! When at last Mouse Herbie steadied, his whiskers quivered. Once again, he smelled the candy hidden deep in the piñata. But how to reach the sweets buried in the burro, swaying high above the plaza? Liquor is split. Mouse scrambled up the tree. He inched across the rope 
like a tightrope walker. One fall in the front and one fall behind. He didn't see cat hiding in the daffodils, his stripy tail switching, his greeny eyes narrow. The piñata swayed as mouse climbed up his the trees. Fruity, sugary, and honey sweet. He nibbled, he gnawed, but he could not reach the treasure inside. Just then came the swish of the stick as a child swung and someone jerked the piñata a lot. Mouse held on tight as the piñata swayed and sailed deep and spun a carnival ride for a mouse in the plaza down the low. Cat waited for mouse to fall into his paw like a ripe plum. <laughs> de mayo. Gracias. 